All right, we glued up the, this uh, violin here yesterday, the top cracks. Taking off the clamps today. Luckily, we were able to glue both at, at once. And it came out nice and flat there. That's just the way we wanted it. We'll clean off the, the excess glue. A oh, nice old violin. No rattles, so we must have got those glued up well. I don't hear any other loose seams. You can tell this violin is old. These are the wear marks on the uh, scroll there. It's from sitting in the case. Or walking back and forth in the case sliding back and forth you also see a couple of dots here it indicates that there were some mechanical tuning machines installed at some point so now we'll put a little varnish over those cracks so that they don't uh, come apart from the humidity Get our little brush out. This is a spirit varnish. It dries quickly. Two types of varnish usually used are spirit varnish and oil varnish. On older instruments, modern instruments, a lot of times they use lacquer for commercial instruments. And I just use a very little bit. The center joint went all the way up here, it was open. It's very little bit of varnish as I need, just very thin so it goes right into the crack wipe off any excess that goes around the sides there give this now a little shot there and we'll give that a, an hour or two to dry and then we'll Rub it out, make sure it's everything else is smooth and blends in with the rest of the varnish. And there we go. And we'll be putting the bridge back on. And some new strings. And there you have it on this old Granary model violin.